Hey guys, so I have a bit of a problem. As you can see from my wall, a lot of my posters have been falling off. Now, before, what I used to do is I just used to put tape on the back of the poster. I'll get this kind of tape, just uh, take a piece, fold it in half with a circle, put it on the back of the poster, put it on my wall, um, and everything will be fine. But uh, when I rearranged my room, what happened was that I put uh, tack instead of tape. Uh, because I have read somewhere, or someone has said, oh, use tech, it's amazing, you can put the posters on your wall, you can take them off, and, you know, the tech just comes right off, you can reuse it, and I know Hank Green uses tech. Yeah, guys, look, the tech doesn't work, I'm sorry, but I don't know if I have, like, a different kind of wall than all of you do. I know my room's a bit drier, and when the posters did come down, I touched the tech, and they weren't tacky anymore. I had to, like, peel it off and knead it a bit to get it back to the the tacky composition this is one that see like it doesn't it's not as good as it was before before it was more like bubblegum you can stretch it for a long time this is like really snappy that's why posters keep falling that's why half the posters on my wall have already fallen down and I gotta use uh, tape to get them back on not the most ideal but you know I'll do it eventually so a while ago, I had worn uh, my mask in one of my videos, and I said, oh, I really wish I had the opportunity to wear it more, and uh, Emily said, you should go to, you know, events and cons, and so I've been looking for steampunk things in the city that, to go to, and actually there's an event that occurs every month, every last Friday of the month, at a bar, that's like a steampunk slash Victorian slash new romantic a soiree. People just get together and if you're dressed in costume you get a free drink pass if you arrive between 11 and 12 dressed in a costume or dressed up for the occasion so that's a thing. The event is called Chronology. It happens once a month so this month it's on Friday the 28th. I'm going to link in the description to that event. Maybe you guys want to check it out. See if you want to come to the city. It looks pretty cool. It ends at 4 a.m. so it's one of those late night type of things. So last weekend on Sunday I went to a Reptile Expo. I didn't really uh, have the chance until now to show you guys what I got. So here's some cool stuff I got at the Reptile Expo. The first is this cool pitcher plant. It goes under the name Saracenia Corral. You can just look, look at it. Doesn't it look cool? There's at least three growing points, but I'm going to let it grow at least for like another year or two before dividing it because these growing points seem pretty small and I want it to have nice, good, robust growth before I divide it into separate pots. So that pitcher plant was called Saracenia Corral. This is Saracenia purpurea. And this is a common uh, purple pitcher plant. It actually grows here in New York and in Massachusetts and most of the northeastern part of the country. Uh, pretty cool. But what I liked most about this plant is that it had a stowaway. Right here in the middle, there's a sundew. I don't know if you can see it, but let's see if I could. Right here, these small leaves. And this right here is a flower pod for, for the sundew. Hopefully I didn't destroy it. Sunday's doing marvelously, marvelously. It's just really cool that it's stowed away like that onto this pot. So yeah, I'm very happy with this purchase as well. This is another cool carnivorous plant I brought. It's called uh, Pingricola laiana. I'll put the word here so you can see what uh, how it's spelled. But it basically has these leaves that come out that are very... Uh, sticky. I don't want to touch them because they're really sticky and gooey. It's kind of nasty. It feels like mucus. But the bugs come and they get stuck on there. And that's pretty cool. It, this one's pretty clean. And uh, I think I'm going to keep it as clean as possible. As clean as I can. For now. So yeah guys, that's all I have to say for this week. I'm kind of tired right now. See you guys. Ciao.